Hi guys, welcome back. It's Joy's Love, the number one empress, and I'm going to be doing a love reading for my Leos. How you guys doing, gods and goddesses? What's going on? Okay. Um, I appreciate it if you guys like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit the bell on the side so you can get all the updated videos when I post them. Um, if you would like a personal reading or donate to the channel, the information will be in the description box below. Check that out. Just cleansing the energy a little bit with a little sage. Take that, take that. And I am too. Thank you, spirit. Okay. Let's do this, gang. So this is my love reading for my Leos. Leo the Lion, King of the Jungle. What's going on? God, so a spirit, I ask that you come into me and let me say your words and I'm my own so I can give my Leo gain the best reading possible, as accurate as possible. Thank you, spirit. Amen. Let's see. How are you guys doing? Okay. All right. So right now, Leos, you gotta, you're in like some type of long distance relationship to where, you know, you feel like that your partner is, you know, not paying you that much attention and just focusing on their money and it's giving you anxiety. It's, it's making you a bit paranoid. You're wondering what is this person's doing and you're trying to act like everything is fine, but you are stressed. You're stressed out. You're feeling defeated. You're feeling um, like you're in a dark space. You're overthinking the situation. And you want to, you know, talk to this person. You really want to talk to them. And you're thinking about calling. Okay? You feel like that you're in a crossroads right now when you just got your guards up because you feel like your person did you dirty. You feel like your person, you know, was a big... Um, negligent of your feelings and your heart and you just don't trust them anymore okay Leo's you feel like that you know um, you showed up at your party I know that and you can be dealing with a Scorpio as well okay you're at a crossroads right now where you just really you know um it's thinking a lot you know you're 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 it's it's a burden on you you feel like this is too much you just really want your happiness and you kind of realizing that the situation is over but you don't want to close this chapter yet you still love this person you feel like this is your happiness but you know that the situation is dead and over because you trying to manifest them back Okay, you know it's over. You know it's over. You got the death card and the tower card right after each other. But you're just really trying to manifest, use your skills to manifest this person back. Yeah, you're taking your time. You know it's going to take a, a minute, but you look like you want to manifest this person back. Okay, you're taking your time. You're thinking about it. You don't know if this the right move to make, but you, uh, okay, you know that, you know, you feel like that you're in a third party situation, that your person got somebody else, but you want to stand up in your power and you want to confront them and talk to them and tell them how you feel. You feel like that you grew up. You feel like that you grew up and you feel like that you're ready to put everything in the past and you're ready to let them know how you feel. You want peace, a peace of mind with them. You want um, togetherness. You want them back. You want your home life. You want stability. And you want your person and you want them now. Okay? With the Queen of Cups, you like this person is so loving and kind. And, you know, this person gives you some energy to where you never had it before. You feel like this person is a blessing to you. But 
Right now, you just, um, you know, taking your time. You're very, you're taking your time. And you feel like your person is focused on their money and not really giving you the energy that you deserve. So, you look like you're going to be charging in, but... I don't think this is really what you want. You just used to this person, Leo, and you're thinking about this person and all the good times, but you do have to think about what all you've been through with this person, you know, and how you really feel, you know. You got to use logic over emotions, Leo, you know. With this night energy, um, you guys have ways to go in your growth process. I think you need to turn that energy to yourself and, you know, you know, give yourself some time, okay? Leos, you, you, you know, just think about it. That's all I'm saying. Think about it. I'm going to give you an oracle card. The song that's reading up, Leos. I have an oracle card spirit. Thank you for this reading. Can I have an oracle card? You got deep replenishment. Retreat, rest, be held. You see, you need to, you know, go off and just be by yourself. Get you some rest so you can get replenished. And you can, um... You know, get some rest so you can think about the situation and you can work off of, you know, logic, not emotions, okay? You need to hold yourself. Go within. You know, feel them feelings. And if you still want to go towards this person, then you could do that. But, you know, for now, just go off and be by yourself and, you know, retreat. You know, just take some time and do some one-on-one, -on -one, okay? All right, Leos. Well, good luck with everything, Leos. Thanks again for rocking with your girl, Joyce Love, the number one empress. Um, like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit the bell on the side. You know, all of that good stuff. Good luck with everything. I love you guys. Um, get some rest. Get some rest. And think about your situation before you act. That's my advice. But to each is on. I love you. And peace.